My friend Christian, the guy behind 100 episodes of Street Food Videos in China, asked me this question in a new series we're calling Pen Pals. What's up, Ford? I got a question for you. What inspires you? He asked me a question, I respond, and I ask him a question, and he responds. So watch his video, which is linked in a card or an annotation or below in the description, and then come back here. So Christian asked me, what inspires me? Basically everything you said in your video. No, cats do not inspire me. Nah, Nature stuff can inspire me quite a bit. I like beautiful vistas. Even those cheesy motivational posters, if they have nice vistas, a word that will forever be ruined by Windows Vista. Thanks, Microsoft. I even like fictional vistas. I found a subreddit called Imaginary Castles, definitely my favorite subreddit. No politics, very little controversy in the comments, sharing spectacular original paintings of cool castles. I find it refreshing. Definitely the two things you mentioned inspire me, ideas, and conversations. And I'm absolutely the same as you, Christian. I'm an introvert, and when push comes to shove, I generally try to avoid human contact. So that's the paradox of being a creative introvert. Just need to get out there in the wilderness and get along with my thoughts feels more comfortable. But that does limit the good inspiration because a lot of times the introvert inspiration in me ends up going in circles. One of the things that most inspires me artistically is the movie moment. And you, I believe, were the first person to introduce me to that term while we were having really late night greasy food at a waffle house in Panama City Beach, Florida. I had just come up with my first idea for a screenplay called Dark Night of the Soul, a psychological thriller that was as pretentiously terrible as the title suggests. And you said the film had some good movie moment ideas, those moments in a movie that are pivotal plot points with a memorable twist or image, which was a nice way to soften your attempt to tell me that the movie was pretentious nonsense, but I couldn't hear it at the time because I was stuck in my own introvert inspiration spin cycle. My idea is awesome, man. It'll change the world, dude. It's a psychological thriller like no other. It's like the three, yo. Since then, I've noticed movie moments a lot. Little perfect mini films telling a complete story in the matter of a few seconds or one scene. Buzz Lightyear's epiphany that he's not a flying toy. Clearly, I will. Go sailing no more. There were like three of these in Steven Soderbergh's traffic for me. Quintessential, Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade when Indy has his fingertip on the grail before it's going to fall. I, I can almost reach it. So I got a fun game idea. Speaking of Indiana Jones, I'll do a part of a scene. You do the other actor's part whenever you get a chance. No pressure on time. It doesn't have to be in the next video. I'll edit the two together and then include it at the end of my next video. Whenever you want to act out half a scene you want us to do, I'll do the other part and you include the full scene in your video. It's like correspondence acting. Here's the first one. And there are four characters, <clears throat> always complicating things from the get-go. But I'm pretty sure we not only know this scene by heart, but we've probably reenacted it multiple times as kids, so this one should be pretty easy. And since I'm picking the scene, I get to pick the parts. <laughs> Action! What does it mean? This this junior. I like Indiana. You were named after the dog? <laughs> Got a lot of fond memories of that dog. Ready? Uh-huh. Yes, sir! Ha! So you play the other two parts, Christian. And finally, I'm passing on Christian's question to two other YouTubers. Chris Jordan back in the US who is doing a video a day in April challenge. So here's a video idea for you, Chris. Answer the question. What inspires you? And to Pradeh Agarwal, the Naughty Kid Productions here in Delhi, and anyone else who wants to chime in, be our guest, answer the question, upload it to YouTube, post it in the comments, or just post the answer in the comments. All right, Christian, I will have a question for you probably tomorrow, so see you then. Pen pals, let's do this. Hope you enjoyed this new idea, pen pals. Subscribe to Christian's channel over here, subscribe to my channel over here, and watch Christian's video up here if you haven't seen it yet. Tomorrow I'll be posting another video asking my own question to Christian, so stay tuned tomorrow for that one. And of course, you are all welcome to participate. See you tomorrow.